when we um, have uh, a sequence on our timeline, it's possible to mark it in an out point on the timeline. So if you press I and O on the timeline, normally you're marking out a big area so you can see where it's marked out. But sometimes you might have been practicing with shortcuts and you've marked out a very small area at the beginning of the timeline, which is basically invisible. Now that's fine, it's not going to affect your editing, it's not going to really change anything you're doing, um, except maybe until you go to export. So when you go to File, um, Export, and Media, there's a setting in here um, that has uh, Sequence Into Out set up here at the bottom. Okay, So basically, now what's going to export is that one frame that I've highlighted right at the beginning of my sequence. So if I press Export now, it's going to seem great because it's a really quick export. I'm going to get an MPEG-4 file, but it's actually going to be a very small amount of my sequence. So if I come down here, I can stretch this out okay, in the export window to um, select the whole sequence. Or um, I can grab the work area, which would be the same thing. So it would kind of expand uh, all the clips I have on my, my timeline. Okay, So basically, um, if you do have an area selected like this, um, then just keep an eye out for the duration of your, your kind of final export when you come in here. So one thing to check is the format and the resolution. And then we should see somewhere listed here it will tell us uh, the duration uh, of the export, which is here, one frame. So on the bottom right-hand corner. Um, so we're basically seeing that that's not really what we want. Um, if you have those in and out points marked on the timeline, then you can use Option or Alt and X, and that will remove the in and out point. Um, but having said that, the in and out point are useful, because if you're exporting out part of a video, then you might only want to export out that range that you've selected. Okay. So basically we can control what we export um, when we're uh, kind of making a selection on the timeline. Okay.